Good morning, Fit Cheeks and Fit Beauties. Today, I'm going to give you guys a what I eat in a day to keep this way snatched, to keep hitting my goals, and to keep showing up for myself. So, keep watching. You know she wants a mom, but she tattooed that ass I'm a lover boy, she got her toys She becomes you a rider Just that roll myself a day and count my fingers Okay, so today at the gym, I was working upper body, so of course I need that pump today because I was not feeling it. So I went in with my pride mixed with my oxy shred because I have a super duper high tolerance. And with that being said, EHP Labs is having a huge Black Friday sale. So if you're interested in trying out these products, if you're interested in getting some products that's going to get you pumped up and going to kill your workout, go ahead and use the link below to save money. And get your products today. So I just made it back from the gym, y'all. If I'm being really, really transparent today, I did not feel like doing anything. I didn't want to wake up. I didn't want to work out. It was one of those days where I kind of woke up feeling like, ugh. But uh, like I tell everybody and I tell my clients and I tell myself on um, these days is when you really need to show up because that's sometimes just what you need to show yourself. Like even though you might be feeling a certain way or you might be feeling down, you still can show up for yourself and it gives you that boost, that confidence that you need to just keep yourself going. And I tell people all the time, like motivation is not what got me out of bed this morning. It's discipline. Discipline got me out of bed this morning because I know that I have goals and I know that if I don't don't show up I will feel like girl you know you should show up so that's why I showed up so now we're gonna after we finished uh, finish now that we finish our workout we're gonna just nourish our body with something good for the soul like I just want something that's gonna make like I don't know like I just needed something good for the soul so y'all already know when I say something that's good for the soul we're doing chicken and waffles and I'll eat chicken and waffles all day y'all my protein goal is like 170 grams of protein if I'm not mistaken let me be clear. So I have a pretty, pretty high protein goal. So I have to make sure I get it all in. Yes, I have 170 grams 
of protein to get in daily. And if you are struggling with protein, chicken breast, egg whites, eggs, salmon, steak, chicken thighs, pair that with your favorite carbs and you might have to do a lot in one sitting just to make it work because sometimes i get really really behind on my protein and another tip that i will give is if you have a certain protein goal so say your protein goal is 180 so you can divide that by how many times you want to eat a day so if you want to eat five meals in a day divided by five that means each meal should have approximately 36 grams of protein and when you think about it 36 grams of protein is like one protein shake or about three, four, four to five ounces of chicken tenders or less than eight ounces of chicken thighs or about six ounces of shrimp. Like it's very, it's very doable. Of course, it will make you uncomfortable if you're a person that doesn't really have a huge appetite. But the whole goal of going on a weight loss journey and trying to change your physique and trying to upgrade your fitness level is about being uncomfortable. So don't expect for it to feel super duper normal when you stuffing all this protein down your throat. So with that being said, I'm going to make me some chicken tenders, some waffles, and some eggs because I need to get all that protein in. So I'm going to to make that and I'll show you guys the finished product. So my sweet tooth kicked in, so I made me a rice cake with peanut butter, some Ghirardelli, salty caramel chocolate, and that crumble of Oreo on top, y'all. I was sitting here craving something sweet, and instead of me just devouring a whole pack of Oreos, I just made a little bit of everything I wanted in one. So yeah, here's my cute little snakey snake. And I warmed it up in the microwave so the chocolate can melt. But you can make this however you want. Any like thing that you're craving, you can put it on top of the rice cake just to give it a base and go for it. So y'all saw that rice cake, right? So that means I really didn't have no carbs for dinner. So I just went in with some chicken thighs and some egg whites. And I put a little sugar-free syrup in there just to give it some flavor. And I ain't gonna lie, it did the trick. Alright you guys, so that concludes my what I eat today. Trying to keep it simple, but still trying to keep it cute and creative. 
So I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Let me know what y'all think about these meal ideas. And if you try my, let me know how you like it. And one more thing, my Black Friday sale is live. All nutrition plans and workout programs are on sale for $25 or less. You can get your macros calculated based on your body sets and your goals. Gym plans, I have at-home plans that works on progressive overload. And then I have two of my OG plans that will literally not be available after the Black Friday sale. So go ahead and snag them now. I will put it in my details below. And get your Black Friday sale back because if you start your routine now and start your journey now, come January, you'll be ready to hit it hard. Don't say I didn't warn you. And one more thing, try Chick-fil-A sauce with some syrup and then we can talk about it. Y'all know I'm weird with combos. Chick-fil-A sauce with a little bit of a syrup and tell me what you think. But with that being said, y'all already know the drill. Come back and mess with your girl. Peace out.